So what is the current solution to managing T1D? The tools you are provided with by your healthcare team are exogenous insulin, which you must inject, blood glucose testing devices to test blood glucose levels, nutrition recommendations with 45 to 65% of total daily calories from carbohydrate foods, plus carbohydrate counting methods and various formulas for dosing insulin. And what you are trying to achieve is the goal for type 1 diabetes, to try to emulate what the body does naturally, which is to keep the blood glucose level as close to normal as possible to delay or prevent complications. So what are the outcomes for those with T1D who follow the guidelines? Unfortunately, they are not working with one 2018 study showing that only 17% of American children and adolescents are able to achieve the American Diabetes A1C target a target which is actually much, much higher than the goal of treatment to keep the blood sugar as close to normal as possible. And in fact, the outcomes are only getting worse, not better. Despite the latest advances in technology, such as insulin pumps and CGMs, and newer, faster, and longer acting insulins, current youth and young adults with T1D in the US have worse glycemic control than earlier cohorts. And why is that? Like, Despite the latest advances in technology, why is the current solution and strategy provided by our healthcare teams failing? 